Hey everyone, welcome back. Today we have a dessert recipe for you guys. We're making some simple almond butter blondies. Keep watching. All right guys, we are back. We have missed you, but we have been busy with our personal and work lives. But we're happy that we're back sharing some quality content with you guys. So now that we're entering the fall season and Thanksgiving is around the corner, um, you know, it's good to freshen up your baking skills. So that's what we'll be doing today. Um, I'm a baker. I like to bake year round, but we have this simple recipe that you can start with and maybe we'll get a little bit more expert with it as we go on. So let's move into the ingredients that we'll be using. As you see, it's pretty simple. We have only six ingredients that we have that we'll be using. So first, let's start with our almond butter. Uh, you can substitute the almond butter for a different nut butter. You can try it with peanut butter or cashew butter. We'll be sticking to this, and I do recommend using organic because the other types of um, nut butters that you'll find, um, the more generic ones have more oil, and that affects the consistency of your final product. You wanna make sure that it has the right consistency, so try to stick to organic. We have our natural sweetener, some raw honey, some baking soda, uh, some salt, and then this is our chocolate source right here. Good quality chocolate, 64% cacao, which is nat more natural. And then we have one egg that we'll be using. If you wanna keep it a vegan recipe for our vegans out there, you can use the flax egg instead of the a regular egg. So, before we get started mixing everything, please make sure you have preheated your oven to 350 degrees, which we have done over here. We have also greased our pan. So this is ready to go. We've lined it with parchment paper and greased it so it sticks. And that is it, let's get started. So we are ready to mix our ingredients straightforward. We're just gonna mix everything except our chocolate chunks right now. So take your nut butter, pour it in your mixing bowl. This is a cup of our almond butter. Next, we're, we're adding a third cup of honey. All right, we're gonna take our egg, crack it in here. Oops, got a little shell in there. If you didn't know, that's the trick to take um, pieces of the eggshell out is just to use another part of the shell. We recently learned that ourselves. So we're gonna take a quarter teaspoon of salt, half a teaspoon of our baking soda. Once you have these ingredients in your mixing bowl, you're just gonna mix it together before adding the chocolate. So we have everything here in our bowl. The last thing that we'll be adding is the chocolate. Um, this is about a half a cup, half a, yes, half a cup of chocolate chunks. You'll see that because we got the chocolate bar, not the chocolate chips, we cut it up ourselves. But this is a more pure form of chocolate. It gives it that nice bitterness that we personally like. You wanna make sure that you don't leave anything in here, unless you're like Kevin and you like to lick the bowl at the end. All right, so we have everything ready and we're just gonna pour this into our parchment uh, lined baking tray. Once you have it in your tray, just try to use your, your spatula or whatever other kind of utensil you're using, but just try to make sure you spread it evenly in your tray. There you go, guys. And this is ready to go in the oven. So again, we have our oven preheated to 350 degrees. We're gonna put our mixture in here and let it bake for 20 minutes. There you go. And we'll be back with the taste test. There you have it, guys. I'll pick up a piece and show you. Oh, I'm gonna show you this piece. Almond butter blondies. blondies. Yes. You know, I gotta smell it. it smells. Almondy. That's <laughs> smells sweet. 
and nice. All right. Nice fall treat. Ready? So we're gonna dig in and give you guys our honest review, um, which we always do. Here you go. We but both we're, get we're big pieces. Cook, so. All right. Ready? Yep. Salute. Oh, hold up, hold up, hold up. I have a better idea. How are you just gonna a... interrupt me mid bite? I have a better idea. We're gonna do it the right way. Okay, let's give Kevin a few minutes to get his <sighs> together. We got some milk. Okay. Milk and cook. Oh, <laughs> I'm making a mess. This is typical Kevin. I'm making a mess. <laughs> Back in the fridge. Odie, what are we gonna do with your dad? Clean up time. Odie! <laughs> That's exactly what I wanna do to him. <laughs> All right. Now we're ready to do the taste test. All right. Sorry about that, guys. All right, taste test 2.0. <laughs> we got some organic grass fed milk, cow's milk, and we got some almond butter blondies. Yeah. Go ahead. And ladies first, I'll let you. Hold on, wait, I don't know if I, oh wait, it, okay, there you it go. It goes. <sighs> okay, I got it. And there you go. Okay, ready? Salute. Wow, really good. Really soft. Mm-hmm. They're a little crumbly. Mushy, but very delicious at the same time. Yeah. They're moist, they're very light. But like I said, honestly. Ooh, it's got a big piece of chocolate. Sorry. <laughs> it's really good. Um, They are a little bit crumbly in your hand. So they, they, it's, it comes apart a little bit, especially if you do like us and dip it in the milk, it <laughs> might come apart in the milk. But they taste wise, they're very good. Guys, this is a type of dessert that you shouldn't mind getting messy. Like, mm -hmm. get your hands dirty mm -hmm. and, you know, get some milk. Dip the be a kid. blondies in the... Yeah, exactly. Be a kid. <laughs> Having dessert is all about being a kid yeah. and enjoying it. If you found this video helpful, please hit that like button. And if you're new here, please consider subscribing so we can continue to grow our channel. The recipe to this amazing almond butter blondies are in the description below. Also, the links to our social media, so please follow us. Leave your comments in the comment section below. And until next time, be well and stay safe. Peace. Bye guys.